How's it going everybody? This is Mark. Today I want to show you some hidden features in Chrome that will allow you to enable and disable things that you want to make Chrome more suited for you. These are some hidden features that may have not come out yet that are in testing, older features that are removed, and it also allows you to remove new things that you might not like. So how do we get there? It's pretty simple. It's a built-in web page inside of the Chrome browser. It's chrome colon slash slash flags. It'll take you to this page. We have available and unavailable. From here, we can see a whole bunch of features that may be enabled, disabled, or set to default values. There's descriptions on all of them so you can learn about what you want to do. I remember about a year ago, there was a feature that Chrome was testing where it did um, previews on tabs you had open, similar to Safari, where if you hover over a tab, it gives you the name and it gives you maybe a preview of the picture like I have right here. Well, they got rid of that out of a version and I liked it. So I went through here, I found tab hover cards and I enabled it. So there we go. I now have tab hover cards. So that's pretty cool. In the latest update of Chrome, I got this right here, this little drop down arrow, which allows me to search through my tabs. I don't have a lot of tabs open very often, so I don't feel like the need to search for them. So let's go ahead and get rid of that. In the search bar up here, we'll go ahead and we'll search for the tabs. And if we see at the bottom right here, it says enable tab search. So that's a default value, but we can enable it or disable it. We can see it's already here, so it must be enabled. So let's go ahead and disable that. We'll go ahead and relaunch Chrome. And once Chrome reopens, we can see that up here in the top right, that search bar is now gone. We have customized Chrome and made it to how we want it to. That's pretty awesome. There's a lot of other cool things inside of here that you can enable and test out if you want to. So give it a look. Let me know if you find anything cool that maybe I should test out myself. There's a lot of cool things in here. So I'm excited to see what you find out and what you are customizing Chrome for. If you have any questions, feel free to let me know in the comment section below. If you like this video, leave a like and hit the subscribe button for more videos like this. This is Mark with Hat Tech and I will see you in the next one.